next morning we woke up to a fantastic view. Beautiful weather, bird song, snow-capped mountains. One of those very special places on planet Earth. This is where we parked the motorhome for the night and ate breakfast enjoying the solitude of nature. What an amazing location it was. in the midst of this unspoilt paradise. The lake so calm it reflected the sky. Guna had carefully looked at the map and noticed a small road leading right up to the edge of the lake. He found it and we parked there. I've called this film Majestic Norway and there's no denying it's the right title. The scenery is often breathtaking and yet we're seeing about one millionth of it. Were I to explain the beauty of Norway, I should probably describe it as no doubt I have already in other films, as the juxtapositioning of mountains, fjords and sky. I suppose the snow is the icing on the cake. Even in June, it's not unusual to see frozen or partly frozen lakes. It's not that the mountains are high. They are not particularly high. It's the fact that Norway is as far north as the Far East is east. It was a delight to travel through the pristine countryside. Our first destination is Dal Snipper, which is only about half an hour away. It's an area we've been very close to many times, but this is my first visit. You want a glimpse of Norwegian countryside in June? Unspoilt, raw nature.
up and up we go, because when we reach the summit, we'll be on top of the world looking down on creation. The Osmo Pocket doing a great job. Soon the Gairanga's Skywalk at Dalsnipper is in sight. The view took my breath away. Majestic Norway. Above Gairanga Fjord, a mini troll ladder. We'll soon follow that road to the legendary Troll Stegen. The cruise ships, surrounded by nature. What views they get from there. As we survey the scene, it's a spiritual moment. A masterpiece of God. Certainly awe-inspiring. They've really done a great job of the lookout. Even children can safely stand in awe. We're really on top of the world here. Visitors just sit and wonder. Steep, long and winding roads pave the way for others to come and see. Standing at the top, I find myself shooting the same shot ten different ways, not wanting to miss an opportunity to record it for posterity. Such is the sight. Seems I'm not alone in the quest. When cruise ships dock in Gairanga, they run bus trips to various places, and I did notice tour buses here. No wonder. There's something about places like this that takes the human soul to a different level. Almost an out-of-body experience, as though my feet aren't touching the ground. I feel my spirit soar my mind embrace another facet of life. I wonder if they all feel it. Certainly Gunnar is enjoying the moment. We then enjoyed a lighter moment with the troll. This is a shot of Guna and the troll. On the right is uh, Guna, and uh, down below is uh, But it's time to move on. Back to the vehicle. What an experience it's been. 
Guna really excelled this time. <laughs>